So, did anyone get the connection between all of them players? No, if you didn't, the connection is they've all been allegedly signed by the board and not Arsene Wenger himself. Which sort of says it all really as to why they've not really been given a chance. And before people start screaming and commenting that Xhaka does play, yes he does play and he does play regularly now. But we all remember at the start of the season he wasn't getting games and we were all crying out for him to play. The only reason he did start getting a run of games is because of injuries. And we're so fucked in central midfield that he has to play. Um, you know, Lucas Perez, like, wow. If, if what he's come out with today about he didn't know that he wasn't number nine anymore until he looked on Arsenal.com. If that is true, that's unbelievable. That's disgusting treatment of the player. Um I think he's been fantastic since he joined. I doubted the signing and I'm the first to hold my hands up and say I was wrong because from what I see of the guy last season when, in, when he did play, he's fantastic. And how we're even going to get rid of the guy when in my opinion he's better than Welbeck, who again is another one that Wenger allegedly didn't sign. Um, the reason I left him out is because he's obviously had two massive injuries. So a bit unfair to stick him in there, but... But yeah, if it is true, then wow, classy Arsenal, eh? Real classy club. You know, I, I just find it hard to believe that a player of this guy's quality. Yes, he's not a well beater, but let's all let's all remember this. Yeah, he is or was at the time our record striker signing, our record transfer fee for a striker at the time. So, you know, scandalous in my opinion. I think he's I think he's done very, very well. We all remember the goal against Bournemouth last season where he volleyed one in. So, yeah, I'm a little bit gutted that he's come out with that. And if it is true, wow, what can you say? And I wish him all the best for the future because his future is clearly not at Arsenal, sadly. So, yeah, a little bit gutted with that one. But what do I know? Anyway, let me know your thoughts on Lucas Perez, whether you'd bin him or whether you'd keep him. Um, if you haven't subscribed, you can down below and um, smash the like button. Smash it to pieces. Thanks very much for watching.